So we learned what Angular is, but maybe you also heard about the many different versions Angular has. And at least you probably noticed that this course is about Angular 6 right now. So what's up with all these versions? We got 6, 5, 4, 2, 1. What's up with these versions? Well, Angular 2, back at the time in 2015, 2016, was a complete rewrite of Angular 1, which was the first Angular framework released. That was released quite a couple of years ago. Now, Angular 1 was the first framework to really make single page applications and this better way of manipulating the DOM popular uh, back in the times. Angular 2, as I said, was a complete rewrite to fix many of the problems Angular 1 had though, mostly performance issues. Now, Angular 4, 5, and 6 really are just the latest versions or more recent versions of Angular 2, as strange as this might sound. So in general, we refer to Angular 2 or higher as just Angular. So the framework is now called Angular and it simply has different versions. Angular 1, on the other hand, is not related to these versions, so it's not related to Angular 2 plus and therefore we refer to that as AngularJS to differentiate these two frameworks. Now the Angular framework, where currently Angular 6 is the latest version, and that's the version you're learning in this course, is not a complete rewrite for every new version. Instead, we just have incremental small improvements. And indeed, the code you learned for Angular 2 is pretty much the same for Angular 6. There just have been some tweaks and some tiny adjustments. So we're not talking about big changes between these version numbers. Though Angular 6 is the latest version, as I said, and it's the version covered in this course. Now, important, Angular 1 is not related to Angular 2+, plus. that's important. And in this course, we'll learn Angular. So Angular 2 plus and essentially Angular 6 since everything you learn in this course is the latest Angular code version you can learn.